Hello. We're back for Bellatrue. Trying to climb the sticks with the abandoned deck. Nope. This deck. Wait. Yes. Green stick. Required score scales faster for each ante. Oh, okay. Just gets harder. So this is the same, but next ante should be different. I don't know how good this is, but I think it's interesting enough to try. Let's see if four towers will make the difference. Oh, I am the abandoned deck. Pernus Lucky Glass Malt. Do you get to use two of these? I think I'm kind of down to do something like this. Make a joker, probably. That's really bad. <laughs> uh, do I want to make hearts? I think I'm down to make some hearts. We should have made this ace a heart. This is basically just two dollars. Spades are debuff. Three, four, five, seven, three, four, five. Six. I have a wheel. I had a lot of wheels last time with this deck. It's not the only hand, but a fun one. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Need a six. We have a lot of sixes left. I'm gonna dump all these. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And then oh, I was gonna say I don't know what to do for the last hand, but we don't need to do anything. To do this could actually pay out. It's not that hard to make a straight flush in this deck. I don't think it scales hard enough though. This fortune tell already is six malt. That's pretty good. Could buy this now, or I could buy this, or I could buy this. I think actually this is just better than all of those things. Random Joko. Could make more hearts. How? I think I actually am into straight flushes enough. Really wish I could buy this. Uh, that doesn't give me anything. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Two, three, four. Still need six or oh, we don't have an ace. So there's no double straight draw. What? Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. I was like, that's definitely a straight. Is this... See? We would have triggered... Uh... Whatever that card's called. Pretty easily. I think it's usually 800 for the small blind. Diamonds. Wouldn't mind this buffoon pack, but... We have three, three, four, five. We're actually pretty close. Just need an ace. Don't think that was the right move. And yet I keep doing it. Okay, I'm going to try and hit the straight flush, I guess. Uh, I'll do this instead. Nope. Two, three, four, five, six. Not the best. Is that even worth that much? Not worth that much. How many aces do I have? Four? Three sixes? I have to play cards. I have to hit the last, last straight. Might be okay with this two pair. I think the 
No, I think the chips are more, better than the malt, actually. 7, 8, 9, 10. Yeah, this is the best hand we have. That was just enough. Actually, that was maybe the best hand we played. Never, never been able to buy this, which kind of sucks. Blue Drick are also not that good. Popcorn, probably necessary, unfortunately. Trades just aren't that good. I mean, popcorn's good. This is only going to carry me for so long. Do you like Riff Raff? Don't really like Magic Trick. Don't really want to skip. Pair. Doubler is good. How good is this flush, I wonder? We'll find out. Probably good enough. Yeah. But we're missing flat mold. I'll just play whatever's in my hand, basically. I don't think it really matters. I haven't really used any towers either, actually. Splash is okay. I think I'm down to buy this. Four fingers is pretty good, I think. Sell juggler. Sell popcorn. I don't need popcorn. I don't want to sell Riff Raff though. I guess I just make one Joker. It's okay with me. Flush Buckler? That's pretty good right now. Oh, I need four cards now. That will also make making straight flushes easier. Interesting. These aren't that good. Good enough. I think popcorn is done though. Flush popcorn actually seemed decent there. Oh, baby, we can ride the bus. Supernova also seems pretty good. So this. Are we keeping Splash Buckler? I think we are keeping Splash Buckler. Alright, this is a decent amount of stuff. I think this is good enough to get us over the line. It's not shortcut. I do get uh I do get four figures and shortcut mixed up a lot. Obviously if you have both it's good, but I don't have both right now. I do need to play a bunch of hands to make ride the bus better. I do think that just playing cards will get us there though. Three, four, five. I should put ace, whatever. Yeah. Because I do want to ride the bus. Five, six, seven, eight. I should just play an ace. I think this is enough. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Alright. Played a little conservatively there at the end, but I think that's okay. Yeah, this, I think, I think this is enough scaling, even though this fortune teller kind of stopped doing stuff. Making a tarot, pretty easy in this deck, but I don't think, oh, never mind, I have fortune teller, what's wrong with me? I think ride the bus is going to be good enough, so this might be a little dicey, but I'm going to sell swashbuckler, and then... Now I try and make as many ace straights as I can. And we ride the bus. Yep. 
I was like, can I play these again? Oh. That might have worked, actually. I didn't think about that. Oh, would that have worked? That might have worked. I think if you play a four card straight and then just have an ace in the hand that doesn't score, I think that triggers superposition. So I could have actually triggered it there. I'm pretty sure. Might have been bad. That's can't be good. That's not good either. A bunch of fours. I have more fours than sevens, but this straight is better. Guess I'm gonna play this. Oh, it is a straight flush because of four fingers. That's pretty good. Little less molt. Actually, that might have been bad. Am I dead? No. Two, three, four is a straight. I'm gonna make this ten a steel card. I think I might have punted. Also, this straight makes a card now. Oh, that's savage. Okay, I think I threw that away. I also maybe wasn't scaling fast enough anyway, but I don't think I played very well. Oh, the pillar is such a frustrating first boss blind. Because all my cards are going to be bad now. But I have to play because I need the money. Uh, okay. First discarded poker hand each round. Hmm. I think I'm gonna go all in on pair instead of high card. Those are kind of the two, like, ways to build around this. It's not enough. I think this is enough. Okay. <laughs> It was kind of close. Now I need something that scales fair. Oh, nailed it. This juggler would have been really nice, but I am broke. I think this is good enough. It's good enough for this at least. Nice. This might be able to scale fast though. Trigger. I think this is good. I actually don't think I want Hanging Chad. I think I just want to play. Should be able to discard a pair every time. Uh, let's make these aces. Bonus aces. These are my best scoring cards, so might as well make them better. I guess two pair would also work. Supernova would be really good here. Just some flat molt. That counts. Mercury is good. I feel like I... Oh, I didn't even check what that was. This feels bad, but that's okay. I think I kind of have to scale it. Nice. Alright. I think we're scaling. Got off to a good enough start that I think we'll be okay. Oh, that's oddly specific and good. All spades are debuffed. You got it. Goodbye, threes. Uh, I'll play this tens first, I guess. We do want to win quickly. Like, there's no incentive for us playing more hands currently. Except, like, maybe supernova, but it's not really worth the trade-off when you could just make more money. 
I don't think I want any of this. I think I'll just buy bank card because it's cheap and it makes abstract joker better. Do you see a lot of pairs when you have 12 less cards in your deck, it turns out. 5k, just on that hand. It's pretty good. No more superposition. I feel like I've been baited by superposition. <laughs> uh, I have to buy it now, right, if I want this voucher? No, I can buy it next round. Well, I'll buy it next round, then. Don't Joker. Just gonna go to the moon. Wow. Actually, the... Nice. Mm. We're cruising, for now. I feel like I'm gonna hit a wall, but... Oh, that's unfortunate. I was like, oh, green trick is great. And then it's just not quite good enough. I'm gonna buy this crystal ball. Don't think I want any of this stuff. Arcana packs just make my cards better. I don't think it's better than a dollar. Maybe next ante, I'll feel differently. Wow. This is the weirdest thing I've ever seen. That's so weird. Oh no. Hey, I think if I play do this, it's always a pair, right? Okay, yeah. I think we're okay. Alright, nice. <laughs> I was like, I don't want to do any more thinking. I could just barely figure out that that little clump of cards was uh, a pair. I think Swashbuckler's got to be better than Jolly Joker, right? One, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Two, three, four, five, six, seven molt. It's actually not really better. In fact, it's not better. Interesting. I don't know what adding cards does. I guess adding better cards. I'm just gonna open one. Like adding a good card. I don't have face cards. I don't want those. Like adding this bonus eight makes my eight slightly better, right? That seems good. These blinds seem good for me also. Maybe I should have discarded a few more cards, but I don't think so. I'm just trying to ride pair all the way to the end. Need a little bit more malt. Queen? I have no queens. Let me buy the Jumbo Arcana pack. Making all of one card is good. Like this death making another 10, for example, is good. Because I'm just making pairs. Stone card is okay. I think I'm just going to make my 10s better instead. Maybe I should be re-rolling? I don't know. I do think I'm not necessarily playing this run optimally. Uh, how many threes do I have left? Quite a few. I'll just say yes here then. I'm not getting punished yet. But I do need more. Probably now. Although the boss boy doesn't really do anything. Straight isn't happening. Don't really care about tarot cards. 18k. I think I can get 18k. But I feel like I just should spend some money, no? Guess I'll click on this. This 3 seems pretty good. This 2 also seems pretty good. I don't really want to roll. I'm gonna hope I have enough. Oh man, that's so good if I hold on to it. Okay, these eights are gone then. Kind of awkward, but I think it's worth it. I need some alt soon. What do I have left? Aces. Nines. 
I have a bunch of twos actually. I don't have that many threes. I do have fours. I think like this. Yeah, that looks good. Nice. Doesn't help me, but that's fine. Probably sell this actually. Seed money is good. Problem is I need to like win. Maybe I'm supposed to go into debt here. Splash would mean I add score. Tell me how big the blinds are. No, it doesn't. They're big, I imagine. This is too late. Can I get away? No. I don't think it's too late. It's definitely not optimal. Why does it need Joker stencil? This might look completely unhinged. And you might not be wrong, but I am going to try it. I don't think this ever wins. I hope that's right. Okay. Now this seven should win. So here's the plan. I'm going to ride the bus for a bunch. And eventually I'm going to sell Jolly Joker. I had to keep Jolly Joker to win. <laughs> and then hope that Ride the Bus and Joker's Tinsel is enough. Scholar. Holographic Scholar. That is good. But I don't have that many aces. I feel very committed to the strategy already. Which might not be correct. But... It's where I am. <laughs> Burnt Joker keeps cooking. Again, pretty sure this doesn't win. 13,000. Pretty sure this doesn't win. Dang it. Okay, that's actually really bad. I lost two malt for ride the bus. Can't buy abstract Joker because it makes... I'm just going to keep going. I mean, I'm so committed here. It seems very dicey, but I am just so committed. Should make it after this. Um, this might win. Nice. Ace will definitely win. Let's play a two. Not that big a difference for bus riding. Okay. That was like, I don't know. Empress makes malt cards. It's pretty good. I'll use that. Stone card also pretty good. Oh, okay. I think this is actually... Well, losing a hand isn't great, but I think it's still worth it. A tower might be worth it. Might need the score help, you know? Mega Buffoon Pack. I don't know if Mega Buffoon Pack is good. I think I'm just all in on... on this working. <laughs> oh, does this win? Ah, that was bad. I, like, went back to make Ride the Bus better and I just... made it worse. Supernova. Supernova seems very much worth it. Okay. This might just be our deck at this point. Might only be two times, but I think this is enough to win. Just three. Eventually I can sell Burnt Joker, I guess, is the truth. Just win. I think this wins. Let me do something else then. Oh, I need to use these. Uh, make these. Nope, not those. I can make these malt cards. How many threes do I have? 
five. How many fours do I have? I guess, actually, I should use it on a three in that if I want to make a stone code, which I think I do. Pretty sure these eights are going to win. Oh, wait, no, I'm trolling. What? What was I thinking? I'm a genius. I actually thought I just lost. I think I got very lucky there. High card. Yeah. Seems fine. Keeping all my money. Joker again. Let's play these eights. Oh. Alright, whatever. I lost like two or three molt, I think, that ante. Yeah? I mean, we are literally scaling the two jokers that scale off of, like, of playing more rounds, so I will take it. Okay, we won't throw it away this time, because we know, we know now that two aces is going to win, because we have learned that it's like 50k, which I think is enough to clear this whole ante. can now buy things again. I think I will buy Arcana Packs. Pluto. No. Hanged Man? Seems okay. Do I even destroy? Don't really want to use any of these, actually. I guess I'll use this. Let's use this Pluto. How's this? Got a Mercury. Good enough. Definitely worth the money we spent. I think these tens will win. I just have to trust at this point. Yeah, I mean, it's a big number. How much? How many hands have we played? 31 pairs. So this is plus 31, this is plus 21. Eventually we can sell Burnt Joker. Uh, buy this, I guess. I guess we should open the packs, actually. Oh, baby. You ready? don't know why I bought Hanged Man, actually. Because I still haven't decided what I'm going to take out. I could take out two tens, but I like my tens. I have a bunch of twos. I have a bunch of... Like, I don't want to reduce anything to under... You know, I'm just going to sell this. I think that was a mistake. Dang. Well, it's exactly enough money to keep max interest. Threes? I do have... Same number of threes and fives, so I'll take the five. This is a bigger number. Thrilling analysis, I know. Uh, we've already figured out that high card is good enough, right? Yeah, 36k. Definitely. Makes sense. Nice. Alright. So, now how hard is the game? <laughs> We've definitely spent a lot of time farming. We have made Pear very, very big. We might not need Burnt Joker anymore, but I'm too scared to throw it away. Lucky card. Steel card also not bad. Down for a lucky ace. I'll buy a pack, sure. This eight seems pretty good. Let's buy that. Just keeping all my money. Uh, these tens can go away. Pretty sure I can clear this with these aces. In fact, I'm not even pretty sure. I'm 100% sure. I have 5k. How much does this make? 77. So I'm making about 50k, I think. Even for my crappy pairs. Buying standard packs. 
This is actually pretty good. It's, it's basically score that doesn't interrupt the hand I'm trying to play. It's pretty good. Could make a bunch of sixes. Don't think I want to... Well, true. Maybe I do want to mess with that a little bit. Make a five to a six and make a... Huh. Could make an eight into a nine. Yeah, seems fine. I don't know. It's like pretty. Margins feel pretty thin on that one. Roll. Rocket? I don't think I need a rocket. Not really in the market to buy jokers, you know? Ooh, this eight's really good. I could just play this ace. I guess I should play a bad high card, right? How many fives do I have again? A normal number of fives. This. To get a discard that's... Alright, whatever. It's not as good as that was the plan, but... I think these two aces always get there. Yeah. Actually, even making slightly more on high card because the molt on these keeps going up. 69. Eventually, it will be even better because Stencil Joker will be better. This. I don't think this is going endless, but I think it's winning. And goal definitely was to win. Again. It's a little too much of my brain power to discard cards. Okay, that's ludicrously good. That's as good as... That's actually just as good as Joker's Tensile is currently. Which I think makes me want to sell Joker's Tensile. Now I can find another Joker. I will take Swashbuckler for now. 12 malt versus 8 malt. I think adding 8 malt before the multiplier is worth it. Don't know though. Fortunately, it will be very hard to not one shot this boss. I mean, these together are like. This is 31 malt plus 35. 66? Something like that. I think we're all surplus. I would like a different Joker to Swashbuckler, but I think Swashbuckler is fine for now. I'm going to open this. Don't know if I'm going to open the other one, though. Yeah, I'm kind of looking for one planet. I think actually maybe opening planet cards is bad. I'm very impressed how consistently we've trigger this burn joker though hasn't been a problem at all uh actually i need the two right just like this i think we have a bunch of twos in my deck that's why i think this one shots yeah that looks like it one shots the needle <laughs> Yes, well, I guess I can open both of these. Keep my... Ooh, number five. How many eights do I have? Five, I have four fives. Is that my other, yeah, my other fancy eight. Sorry, my other like fancy card is an eight. That's what I was trying to say. Six, ten, four. Getting more tens is good. I guess I'll take the 10 then. Fairy's level 30. <laughs> it's kind of absurd. And this is going to the moon. I was just like, wait, I can play high card, right? Sell this Venus. Guess I'll play these aces and get the planet card. It's not worth that much, but I don't know. 
gonna use this Maz just in case we end up transitioning to four of a kind. But I don't think so. I think we're very set for this run, and I think this run is only gonna win anti-8, but we'll see. How much effort to use these stone cards? I just like, can't be bothered. <laughs> I don't know. This run already broke my brain a little bit. Just don't want to like think anymore. <laughs> Extra discard might be better than Swashbuckler actually. Very minor. I'm fine losing the money in the planet card here. Oh, should have. Oh no, never mind. It's the needle. Oh my goodness. I was about to say I should have rode the bus, but no, that was the one time to definitely not ride the bus. Also, that's a very good voucher to hit here. Two skulls for. I don't know how bad Crimson Heart is actually. Didn't seem that bad. Eventually, I think I'll sell Burnt Joker. Uh, should ride the bus. Not like that. Oh, I shouldn't have played the pair, but whatever. I don't think it matters. Nice. I kind of wish I had Stencil Joker still. I do think that Stencil Joker play ended up working out. Maybe that's being hilariously results oriented, but. Thought it was going to be really bad. It didn't seem that bad. Uh, I guess I'll use this. I don't know. None of these seemed great. Just use these. Shared Constellation. Although, I don't really know why I'm asking for extra stuff, given how well this has gone. This is like the second run, I think, where we're going to win off the back of Ride the Bus. Just existing early. Which obviously is pretty good in this deck. 180. A random joker gets disabled every round. I don't know how I feel about that, but I don't think it really matters. We're not going to one-shot it, but we should win. That actually was quite close. I don't think I... I don't think I really thought through how close that was. I think we're done with Burnt Joker, though. I think we're actually done with both of these jokers means we want other stuff. Joker Stencil came back. If I buy this, it's only times two. And that's okay. Ice cream's not bad. I think we're going to win anyway, no matter what. Acrobat might be better than Joker Stencil. I think that's probably true. Hold on to this by this, I guess. Sure, take this five. Alrighty. Oh, that's fine. I don't have Bent Joker anymore. I should still play a pair. Should win. This should win. This was actually pretty close. I forgot Acrobat didn't proc until the last hand, so it actually wasn't close, but. A little bit spicy! We will go endless, but. Don't have high hopes. Oh, we're definitely buying this. It's the perfect time to buy it. I mean, we actually just only have pair scaling. We have a lot of pair scaling, but that's all we have. I mean, I need a Joker. Popcorn is fine. This print may be a bit better, but they're kind of the same card. Oh, maybe that Polychrome Joker would have been good. Now I can just kit the NOS on every hand, right? Uh, I can slow play here. 
And then this. I'm just hoping to hit a Mercury for my fool. Telescope would also be nice. Level 35 pair. Ooh, trading card. See, trading card I think would be good if we were trying to like, I don't know, make the deck all fancy eights or something, or just aces. But I think we're past the point of trading card being good because I'm just not going to have very many rounds left to play. So I'm basically going to click on anything that makes me better now and see how far that carries me and I think the answer will be not very far. Like sure I'm getting out of this ante but this ante is not that hard. Could have ridden the bus one more time I guess. Uh, maybe I'll surprise myself. Ooh, this actually seems kind of good. Oh, Square Joker, also good. Do I have enough time to scale Square Joker? Probably not, but it's the kind of thing I need to scale. Can I take the money? I will open these. Take this two. I don't know what's left for me. Oh, whoops. I'll use the next shop. I think it's going to be my last one. Pretty confidence isn't enough. I need to play four cards. I did think correctly that Square Joker would scale. Would work even if you didn't. Oh, crap. That's too many cards. That's sad. <laughs> I did correctly think that Square Joker would activate if you didn't score the other two cards. Oh yeah, Acrobat making a big difference there. But I don't think it's enough. Yeah, I lost four chips on this. I mean, this is going to take so long to get good. I mean, let's open. Let's open these packs and try and hit Mercury. Then roll for a better Joker. I don't know what we can get though. There's a Mercury. Don't think that helps me. I think we're just rolling it all down. Uh, I guess I am committed to a Joker being better than Square Joker. So that free reroll. Well, it wasn't really free. But it was less expensive. Orky? 510s, 5-4s. Banner not really good. Orky might be good enough. Oh, interesting. This is good. I, I'm so curious how good this is. So I'm gonna buy it. <laughs> I don't know. I don't have Square Joker anymore. Maybe it means I should still play more hands. Oh, I'm so dead. These eights better be unbelievable. Interesting. Wow, you go to the next ante? That is wild, actually. <laughs> that is actually good. Wait a second. Are we back? I mean, time on this earth is very limited, but... We may, in fact, be back. By this death, I guess. Makes a pair. Uh, don't think we're vagabonding. I mean, I think we're just dead. If anything has a shot, it's this driver's license. That actually looks pretty good. Huh. Hard do I want to copy? Well, I wanted to copy a fancy eight, but I don't have a fancy eight, so. Fancy ace instead. Ignore the planet cards. Alright! We're still in it! I just don't. I don't see any way out of this. Like, we've, we've basically been at the scaling number the whole time. And it was good enough to get us here, but. 
there's just like no chance it can get us out. Boil is not. Yes. Okay. I always get a little confused. Wait, no repeat hand types. Okay. I don't think this is going to win, but I do know how it wins. And it's not pretty. Like at all. I'm going to start with high card. Okay, didn't trigger the ace. Then I need to play any like two pair, I guess. Yeah, two pair. I guess that has a pair in it. And then I'm gonna use a lot of discards to find fancy eights and stone cards. I think this is worth doing. I think this three is not worth it. All right, we found a fancy eight. I don't know if it's good enough, but this is the best hand we can play right now. Oh, that was actually pretty close. <laughs> that was actually our best hand. All right, well, that was fun. I didn't expect to beat this stake that quickly. I didn't really notice the ante increases very much, but I think that's because I just started scaling so early and my scaling just happened to keep up with and then outstrip the base antes of the game. Definitely, I'm sure as I play more, I'll notice that a bit, but it's nice to win. I like this deck a lot. I think it's cool to play one deck a bit more often and kind of learn the strengths and weaknesses of a build. And I don't know, for whatever reason, the abandoned deck just uh, appealed to me. I think probably because it's smaller and it feels like you can build a lot more combinations. Like it's a bit more volatile, a bit more high variance, but I don't know. That's fun sometimes. Anyway, that was it for this edition of Bolatra. We'll continue seeing if we can climb the stakes with this deck. If not, we're going to have to swap decks and that will mean even more climbing. But uh, for now, thanks for watching and thanks for hanging out.